In May 2014, Vladimir Putin called the Eurovision Song Contest a hotbed of sodomy, a ringing endorsement. The saddest thing to happen this year is definitely the contest being cancelled. But don't worry, because we spent the last few weeks stuck in internet holes and lost on Romanian TikTok, putting together our very own contest. Our mission is to find the very best song in Europe right now, as voted by you, our dear audience. So open a beer or whatever, put some headphones on, and clear some space to move around because it's about to get weird. I'm your host, Duba Butler, and this is Europe's Best Song. All right, so our first tune is from Russia. It's the lockdown song. It came out two months ago and has already had two million people watching it. That's probably because it's got a guy in it who's got a Virgin Mary tattoo up to his nipples. I'm told they're rapping about how gangster they are, how they are in prison due to how gangster they are, and their plans to continue to be gangster when they're allowed out of prison. A message we can all relate to. <laughs> Somebody locked me up because I'm guilty of loving this tune. Well, I was the only one who liked making pastry shoes. Well, that's gonna be going around my head for a while. What a tune. And next up, we've got a lovely entry from Spain's resident noise core nudist DJ, the Virgin Maria. Here's her music video, Lit, where we see her pole dancing on public transport. Somebody call the policia. I'm lit, lit, I'm lit, bitch. This is actually a good technique to make sure people keep their two meter distance. I'm told that the Virgin Maria went through 300 rewrites before settling on these chorus lyrics. Well, that certainly was lit, and uh, sure to raise a few eyebrows on the Spanish underground metro system. If you want to make an official complaint to the Madrid metro, you can. Ask for a form at the passenger service centres at Sol or Plaza de Castilla metro stations, or call the interactive passenger service centre with your mobile telephone. For our next entry, France's national treasure, Lala Antsy, writes a love letter to giant glasses of orangina and shimmering asses. What? Girl, are you an oversized blunt? Because you're giving me severe anxiety just from looking at you. I shudder thinking of the amount of calories in that drink. No idea what she's on about, but I felt that here. Next up, it's best to get the over 60s out of the room because we've got a song from an actual professional witch. She's called Bruja, and if you like your Romanian trance raver trap as much as the next guy, you're gonna like this. It's crazy to see such a U-turn in sound for Evanescence after their hugely successful 2003 hit, Bring Me Back to Life. Thank you, Bruja. Austria's entry comes from Ebo, rapping about her pride in her Turkish roots. Power to you, Ebo. Life. 
Interesting fact, in one of the verses, she's rapping about just finishing her master's architecture degree. Congratulations, Ebo. Danke, 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 danke. This next one's about a top shagger shepherd operating in the mountains of Greece and features Smag Radar, our artist, squatting in a variety of farms. Shout out to all my cow man them inside. All jokes aside, this is a victory for representation of Greek farmers, finally. Shout out to all the, the people in the countryside. A quick but necessary note before we move on. If you, like me, stopped the video at 1 minute 53, that was a 1985 Man 33 and a Pocklean 75 truck, and no, sadly, neither are available on Gumtree. Let's move on. Next up, we've got Shit Kid. And no, that's not Prince George, but Shit Kid from Sweden. Trying to steal Greece's entry's farmer spotlight there, which none of us like to see. Bit of trivia for you. People often think I'm Swedish, but I'm not. Not quite dancing queen, but still wanting to get my dancing shoes on for that. Up next, we got Miss Ketta, a Milano fashion icon, with her bombastic dance floor weapon, Pazeska. Enjoy, and enjoy, if you like it, the gigantic mortadella she sat on. Dice che sono pazzasca, sarà il fascino della tedesca. Vola uno spicchio della mia pesca. Mm, frutta fresca, cambio location, siamo alla festa. Dinamite nella sua tasca. Wow, that is a big mortadello, isn't it? Fun fact, that mortadella was donated from the personal store of American actor Mark Ruffalo. Get in, Mark. Eight million people have got down to that. And as the old saying goes, I'd be way richer if I had a gigantic sausage and a giant bat of body paint. Next up, it's time for Marty energy drinks and sensible haircuts, because Deutschland are joining the party. Take it off, Ali Newman. Geil. Das ist wunderbar. Really makes you think, doesn't it? The eight foot gorilla and the hairy knuckles. Is that the monster? Or is it us? Now we have Charlotte a Didgery with Patanapat, which is Creole for the gecko didn't have any legs. She ain't wrong. Wonder what happened to the gecko and his poor legs. Lock up your mothers, because I want to dance. Haunting. Now the entry from everyone's favourite tax haven, the United Kingdom. Didn't we vote no to Eurovision? Didn't, wasn't Boris going to get us out of Eurovision or something? If you haven't heard of Pete and Baz, the UK's geriatric drillers, 
you should get to know. In this song, we'll hear about how they used to drive a Peugeot with dents in it. But now, due to the vast amounts of money that they earned, they drive Range Rovers. Back then I had dents in a Peugeot. Now I got trains in my chest. Gold, one in each finger. Brand new range in the shed. Sweet as a nut. So good, but I don't give a I don't even care no more. Cooking with Stella is not advised. Down in a Stella with an egg yolk in it, also not advised. This bangs. You can tell by the size. Make dinner from fish with a bailiff. Now throw jewels at the wife. Look at that of my wife. Yeah, that's mine. And that was Pete and Baz reminding everybody that it doesn't matter if you're 80, you can still be UK drill artists who love lager. Salute. And next up, we've got a mean who was transformed into a boy, juiced. Just a tip, he's very mischievous. At the start here, you can see that he's saying, suck my dick, bitch which uh, thousands are agreeing with, and uh, we aren't one of those thousands. Put it away, Juice. Why are you wearing a bandana like that, Juice? God, he really is quite incorrigible. And that's it, ladies and gentlemen. Some pure fire bangers from across this great continent. So the polls, I'm being told, are now open. We can vote to discover, once and for all, the best song in Europe. We'll be back shortly to showcase some live performances from our contestants and ultimately announce the winner. Auf Wiedersehen, ciao, and goodbye, folks. Thanks for joining us. Abianto as well. And the other one, salute.